In regional news, one of the most powerful typhoons to hit Japan in recent years went unusually close to the capital Tokyo, killing two people and causing transport chaos. Typhoon Pasai brought record-breaking winds of over 200 kilometers per hour and driving rain. More than 160 flights were canceled and dozens of train lines, both overland and underground, were closed for hours. Hundreds of thousands of commuters were left stranded during the morning rush hour. Earlier, people had been warned that it was dangerous to even go outside. One of those killed was a woman in her 50s who was found dead on a street in Tokyo. Security camera footage showed the strong winds had blown her off her feet and slammed her into a wall. Dozens of other injuries were reported. More than 900,000 people were left without power, including an entire city, the Kamogawa. The fast-moving storm headed out into the Pacific Ocean before lunchtime, but officials warned that heavy rain would continue for several hours, and there was still the risk of floods and landslides. After the storm, a heat wave. Unseasonably high temperatures are expected because of warm air brought along with the typhoon. Already today, the mercury hit 37 degrees Celsius in Tokyo.